So NVIDIA has released their Crater Ready drivers recently, and they're claiming a performance boost in Cinebench-related stuff, Photoshop, Premiere, and Blender. Now, these drivers are supposed to be for creators. However, a common question is whether the Game Ready drivers or Creator Ready drivers are better for gaming. So let's check them out. First, we're going to take a look at the control panel of each driver. Now, let's start with the game ready control panel. As you can see, this is what you normally get. We got the 3D settings here, we got the little image quality, SLI, surround, physics, G Sync. And let's just confirm that this is the game ready driver. As you can see, this is the game ready driver. This is the latest one as of this video recording and let's take a look at the creative driver as you can see everything looks the same and as you can see we're running the creative drivers so let's take a look at the gaming performance between these two drivers first and see if one is better than the other let's start with the game ready driver and let's take a look at division 2 we get 111 FPS and with the creative driver we get 112 FPS. Now this is within margin of error so in this situation I say they perform identical. Now moving on to Shadow of the Tomb Raider we get 97 average FPS with game ready and 98 with creative ready. So once again there is no difference in gaming in this situation. Now interestingly in Overwatch, I had a really weird result. I got a lot better performance with the Creative Ready driver, and I'm not sure why. I did the exact same method of benchmarking these two, and this is what I got, so take that with a grain of salt. In terms of Fire Strike, we get 27,144 on the Game Ready driver, and I don't expect much of a difference from Creative Ready in this situation. Creator Ready got 27,334, which is, in my opinion, within margin of error. I think temperature will pay, play more of a role than these drivers in this situation. So let's take a look at Photoshop. Now, in Photoshop, it was a little bit faster to do this enhanced details. I used five raw images, did enhanced details and it was slightly faster but nothing significant in this situation maybe in different scenarios it might be faster but here it was slightly faster however for cinebench once again just like the overwatch results i got much better performance with the creator ready driver and this was three runs back to back and this is the average value of those runs i'm not sure why it's performing much better but again just like the overwatch results my creative ready drivers are running better now i did not do a clean installation either so this was a really interesting result just like the overwatch results again take it with a grain of salt so in conclusion this is the exact same situation as the quadro drivers the quadro drivers have a performance driver and a certified driver where the certified driver is older and the performance drivers based on newer drivers. So for Quadros, the performance driver will give you nearly identical performance in gaming as the game ready driver. This is the exact same situation for the creative ready drivers. The creative ready drivers will give you the exact same performance as game ready, or is supposed to give you the exact same performance as game ready. The only difference is game ready drivers will probably come out first for new games and it will take a while for Creative Ready Drivers to come out. As for me, I'll be using the Creative Ready Driver for now until a new game is released and I need to use Game Ready. Alright, so thanks for watching.